Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Um, yeah, so it is like day 12 of Vlogmas and uh, it's about 2 p.m. already and I got a lot of random stuff done uh, today because I had fallen behind because I wasn't feeling so well and please excuse this. I never sleep in my makeup but I was so tired last night and I was tossing and turning I actually didn't end up sleeping I just haven't been sleeping well the, um, since I haven't been feeling well I just have a major like I don't know congestion going on anyway I am starting to feel better my voice is slowly coming back um, it, at times it's like fully back and sometimes I'm squeaking away so sorry this is just it's just what it is. I got a lot of random work done today while they played because we are actually on winter break. So um, we are done until the beginning of the year. So I'm super excited about that, which will give me a lot of time to kind of catch up and plan and make some changes and adjustments um, that I would like to make based on how we've been how we've been learning. So they spend most of their time when we're home in the classroom just surrounded by all of their materials and they just pick and choose what they want to do when they want to do it and I'm fine with that. I take note of it. Um, I take some video, take some pictures so I can log it in our Evernote accounts and uh, call it holiday break learning. I don't know. I did pick up uh, some things from the library, some reading material for them for the holidays and we st we're going to do like gingerbread house uh the gingerbread train that whole deal so i have been stuck in my dining room with my computer here um getting my planning pages revamped not revamped i just took a few things off um and added a few things that i think would make it more um uh make my planning pages um more useful for me so I've been doing that. My voice, it really irritates me. It's probably worse in my head than it is when other people hear me speak because it's just kind of like, you know, your ears are muffled and that's all congested. So anyway, I probably should not be so ridiculous and actually wash my face, but yeah, it's just been that kind of day and where you just want to kind of get the stuff you need to get done done so you can rest and relax for the rest of the night. So this is basically just what I'm doing. So I've got my computer out. I just took out my Facebook, my little Facebook, and my today and to-do planner. I love this planner. It's really nice and simple. I normally try to go for something a lot more fancy and you know, that makes me feel like legit mom, but this one right here I found is the best for me. And the reason is because of the way that they split up the um, sections. So like they, the first sections are just the months. The second section is like the weeks. And then the third section is like the day. And uh, you just put in the um, date here because I don't know about you guys, but I am really bad at planning, you know, faithfully for like, you know weeks at a time and then I just go on this you know two or three week time span where I'm like not using my planner at all and so I'm trying to discipline myself to do better but this planner has really been helpful to me because when I have those spots where I haven't been planning um, I'm not using like I don't I, the pages don't end up useless to me I just start you know where the next day or the next month or whatever it is and I just put in the date that I'm planning so I hope that makes sense but anyway I like this one it's not the cutest thing ever but it's very very functional and I like it um, and then you guys have seen this before this is just my planner which is all a mess right now because the kids kind of sort of got to it and they crinkled my papers you guys I hate crinkled papers and Brian laughs at me all the time because I absolutely hate crinkled papers but anyway I'm literally probably gonna go ahead and photocopy this page so that I can have a nice fresh page that's not crinkled I know don't uh, I cannot be the only one so yeah I'm just gonna open it up make a few adjustments to my pages also you guys um, I know you wanted me to share the planning pages with you and I never got around to doing that I'm so sorry but I just I actually did get close to doing it and then I could not figure out how to make it downloadable on my blog. 
so I probably should have just reached out and asked someone how to make it downloadable on the blog and that would have been easier but mm, I didn't. I'm gonna figure out how to make it downloadable for you guys if you're interested on the blog and um, also I had them, the reason it took me so long is because I had them in separate documents. Each page is a separate document and I was trying to figure out how to get that document like make it one document because I did want to start doing more planning videos to help me when I'm not able to because I do miss some miss some weeks or some days when I'm trying to document in our Evernote um, portfolios. The videos really help me fill in those gaps because I can always take screenshots of things that I've recorded or you know it helps track my memory on what we did so when I finally do get to sit down and go through our Evernote account I can just go ahead and fill it out without I don't know I feel like I'm rambling anyway. Uh, <laughs> So that's what I'm doing. I'm in there doing that, trying to get the kids together. And um, I'm about to show you this atrociousness. Is it atrocious? Atrociousness that is their classroom, playroom. Like, don't judge me. This is just what it is, okay? Hi, guy. He, oh my gosh, you guys. He has been eating lunch for about three hours now, okay? This is like his fourth plate of food. And yeah. Mm-hmm, that is homeschool for you. Um, does, do you guys have kids that eat all day long? I don't know, maybe it's just us. But anyway, look at this beautiful mess here. <laughs> so this is, um, Savannah recently got a big girl bed, so they took her crib mattress and they love just hanging out on it in here. They jump and watch the Bible stories and stuff like that, so whatever, you know. And then this is their Lego land here. I try to get them to clean it up and make it neat, but you know what? It's winter break and they just play and then they'll have to clean it and whatever. So this is kind of what it looks like, you guys. And I don't normally dare come in here because it's just hard to step anywhere, you know? But they're having a good time. So that is what they're doing. And yeah, so this is what it looks like just in case you thought that um, it was neat all the time. I just have to kind of step over it and let them be. They have actually been really, really, really into reading the Bible stories inside of this read and share Bible. So as you can see, it kind of fell apart. It was handed down from someone in church and they actually love it. So I may have to look into getting them a new one because they know all the stories. And then, of course, if you guys have been watching any of our regular vlogs on our family channel, you guys would know that they watch this every day. Way beyond the rock and called out, go further, the arrows went past you. So yeah, they basically watch that every day, which is awesome because they know all the stories and you know, they're a lot more familiar with it when we're actually reading them in the regular Bible. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else, you guys? I don't know. I don't know when I'm going to end this vlog. It really didn't have a rhyme or reason. I just wanted to be able to catch up on what I was doing today. So um, these were some of the things that I had gotten from the library the other day. So this is my little bin. You guys know I have a couple of these around the house. And this one's our library bin. So I've just got books like Bear Stays Up for Christmas. And it was the night before Christmas. Uh, the Gingerbread Man is loose in the school. I got a lot of Gingerbread Man books because we're gonna do the Gingerbread House and the Gingerbread Train. The Gingerbread Man is loose at the zoo. And this one was the Gingerbread Man is loose in the school. The Itty Bitty Christmas, this one belongs to us, and Otis Christmas. They love the Otis books. And then, of course, we've been making our way through the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. The thing about that, you guys, is we actually have this on audiobook, so we've listened to it a couple times, and I've attempted to read it, you know, as a read aloud, and haven't gotten all the way through it, so we just started it over again. And I was feeling like the worst mom ever, the worst homeschool mom ever, because I'm like, why am I not finishing? But um, but it was pretty cool because when I started, I noticed that they were very familiar with the um, you know, the characters, and they had picked up on so much of what I thought because I wasn't consistent with it. Um, 
that they were going to completely not know what it was and I was going to ruin their whole life, but I didn't. <laughs> so they're actually more familiar with the characters. So when I'm reading it now, they're a lot more engaged than they were the first times I tried um, to read it to them. So that works out. Okay. And yeah, that's basically what is going on today, you guys. So I know I'm ending this video kind of abruptly, but I was going to move on to showing you how I plan and then I thought this video was getting a little bit lengthy so I might as well break it up into a separate video. And uh, yeah, so obviously you guys can see that I'm a little bit behind in Vlogmas and that was because I was under the weather and just pushing myself a little bit too hard. But that's okay, I'm going to catch up. I have lots of um, videos to film during the holiday break before we actually start school in the new year. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in our next video. I hope you're having a wonderful holiday and thanks for following along. Bye.